finances, I look to profession, I look to friends, I look to status, I look to a lot of things that I put in place for my support, that I wanted to please, that I wanted to grow to. And I was leaning on the wrong. The Lord had to dry up my support system. He had to shut the skies mm -hmm. that I could say, what is my next step? Mm -hmm. What is my calling? Callings are born through crisis. What are you calling me to do? What's he calling you to do today? Mm -hmm. Are you at a job that you think that you're there for to make money and you're losing the meaning of what God wants you to do there? You're there. Maybe you're there to create change. Maybe you're there to help somebody. Are you in a family that is so dysfunctional that you just want to run the other way, but you can't? You're there for a reason. You're there to be the example. You're there to shine a light. You're there to help and minister to others. What is our support system? Are we able to stretch ourselves? Are we stretching ourselves? Are we looking to heaven and saying, thank you, thank you, Lord. Thank you for Jesus. Thank you that my sin can be forgiven. Thank you that my debt was paid. Thank you. I just wonder if there's anyone that doesn't know a relationship with Jesus today. I started out by saying how lives can change in an instant. And if you don't have a relationship with Jesus, your life can change today. Your life can change in a moment. In a moment, think about it. You live in a state of anxiety, and you live in fear, and you live in worry, and you live in, in all these things that aren't good for you. In a moment, you can give that all away. And give it away because someone else had to be there Jesus had to be there in our place Amen Pat will you dismiss us in prayer Heavenly Father almost feel speechless this morning what more can be said